so um it's been a while it's been a, a few years now since I recorded anything um but I'm back after what four years I'm going to try and unlock Nick Pope for FIFA 20 I don't know how well it's going to go I don't at all I am very very shit at this game and I'm more than likely going to get angry which is going to be quite enjoyable for you guys I hope I hope yeah it's been quite a while and I don't know if I should apologize for that or not I ain't got the most subscribers but you know anyway we are going to try and get Nick Pope the summer heat card I've already done some, got most of them completed, which is nice. Just need to score with my shapeshifters Ribery. Let's just score with some English players. Gonna do it on squad battles, because I'm not putting myself through that stress until I've got to do the Ibrahimovic, which I'll also make some videos on that possibly. I just want to make this as easy as I can. It might not be the most enjoyable video, but if you could possibly leave a like and subscribe, hit the notification bell, that would be most appreciated. <clears throat> oh, I need to put these players in. Yeah, my team is shite. I'm fully aware of this. You don't need to make this known. You don't need to say it. I am fully aware. I did have. Uh, my team was quite incredible not too long ago. Um. And I'm one of them players that sort of just do SBC after SBC after SBC. I did do the Shapeshifters Guarantee pack earlier on in the year, which I did get Ronaldo in, which was lovely. He was very shit. He's very crap in this game. So I submitted him in the 88 plus 5 player pack, which I then got the likes of 91 Immobile. Godin, Chiellini, Copper More 88, it's a load of shit, but I then put them in the icon squads, and I've got Crespo, so, you know, my luck isn't the most amazing thing in the world, at all, it really isn't, let me turn this off, this is probably very distracting in the background, isn't it, the sound? Audio down menu down eleven aside down 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 not playing bell one but still down 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 oh, you can hear my hideous voice right anyway let's get into this should be easy probably won't I'm a fucking oh my fuck off <clears throat> I'm very shit I'm wank I'm Division 9 player, I have never even played or attempted for champs. Well, I attempted it twice and then gave up after five games. One, two, lost three and just couldn't be fucked. So, I just, uh, this game is just not enjoyable, I put too much money into this. And I now literally just play it just so I can play against my mates, but if I get some nice reception maybe I'll play it more and upload it for you guys, you can sort of hear me at my peak fuck you cunt, what the fuck is that? you can hear me at my peak for when I'm angry and it's, it's very unhealthy yeah come on come on, fucking hell, get the fucking ball you pleb come on, thank you Right, run, Crespo. What a ball. And on Bele! 1 0. Easy. Easy PC. Right, where the fuck is Frank Ribery? There he is. Need to get him a goal. Then I need to bring on Harry Kane. His line will then be ended, but I've still got Jaden Sancho anyway, so I can bang a couple goals in with him. Get the Nick Pope done probably won't get him done during this episode to 
depending on how I'm feeling. If I can be bothered with this game, I might do two games or just leave it after this one. Uh, I'm not too sure on the editing, so I don't want my video to be too long, so I might just make it this one episode. And uh, I will just film, I will just do my progress here and there. I don't know how, how or when I will upload the episodes. If I can get, I don't know, 10 likes. I will upload the next one. Possibly. Probably won't get 10 likes. I haven't uploaded on this channel in about 4 years, so I don't really expect anyone to be around anymore. I mean, last I checked, I had 200 subs. So. I highly doubt any of you guys are still around anymore. If you actually did enjoy my videos. Um, I don't know why I stopped. It's, I don't know, just didn't really have the motivation, but I love gaming, I love entertaining people, I love making people laugh, so I know it changes people, it helps people, and it makes me feel good on the inside, it gives me a nice little tingly feeling, oh my god, that was cringe as fuck, come on, come on, dinky dinky, crisp, oh my god, you fucking wanker, Son of a bitch. You also learn that I am a massive cunt <clears throat> during these. I will say some shit, shit which will probably get me into a lot of trouble. A lot of trouble. I'll try not to. I will try not to. I'm not racist, so don't, don't worry. Um, I do make jokes. I do make jokes. And it is only jokes. And if you get offended by it, then fuck yourself, because you're a very sensitive cunt. Really. So, I'm just being open and honest. I don't mean to offend people, because it, it is just jokes, but if you are offended, you're a softie. So, fuck off. If you're easily offended, just don't watch me. Really. I swear a lot. I take the piss a lot. I'm a cunt. Deal with it, or fuck off. End of. Don't be in the comment section like, oh my god, I'm upset, you upset me, because uh, uh, more than likely I don't. Wouldn't, wouldn't really say care, but I know it's jokes, so yeah. I don't mean to offend anyone. Your own fault if you do get offended. Don't expect any apologies at all, because it's all on you at the end of the day. People post a lot of shit that are just jokes and just. Just don't get offended. Just don't. It's just pathetic, really. Now, uh, Ribery. There we go. Ribery gets a skull. Or has he already scored? Oh, I can't remember. I'm just banging the goals and chatting shit, really. So, leave in the comment sections what you have been doing during this whole fucking coronavirus shit. How have you been surviving lockdown? <clears throat> have you been doing the fucking bald haircuts shit? Because I am one of them. I am one of them. I I did go bald. Uh, I have I am now actually keeping to the short hair for God knows how long. But I haven't really done much for the first month of this. I was living with my girlfriend, and then I had to move home. I had to keep I had to self isolate for a little while because. You know, you got to follow the quarantine laws. Ooh. Yeah, I came home, just really just been playing games most of the time, watching a bit of Netflix, a bit of YouTube, a bit of Prime Video. I've started going out now here and there, meeting my mates. But this is my other mate, the Jolly Vlogger. Look him up, great YouTuber. Give him a subscribe. I hit the notification bell for him as well. He's a funny lad, fucking love him to pieces. How have you guys been surviving? Let me know in the comment section. I'm, I want to know what people have been doing. Um, all right, all this fucking. What's everyone's views on this protest shit? I mean, I get it. I get it. It's all Black Lives Matter. But it's just the way that they're saying it is like. The way they're expressing it is basically saying that it's just Black Lives That Matter. Most people and all of these riots and whatnot, I just think it's a bit too excessive. If it's just peaceful, then yeah, that's fine. I understand it's for a good cause. I do. 
but I think personally that maybe they should put on their signs Black Lives Matter too. That's just me. I get it. It is all lives that matter. Black lives do matter. Don't get me wrong, every life matters. But to me, it is all lives matter. All lives matter, that's what I support. Don't judge anyone who's out there going Black Lives Matter. If I see someone with Black Lives Matter sign, I won't say anything. I will support. Because it's for a good cause. But, stop with the fucking riots. Because that is just fucking ridiculous. You're injuring people. You're ruining people's lives. Destroying their businesses, bro. Like, come on. That's just pathetic now. It is. It really is fucking pathetic. It's just let me know what your views are. I want to know if I'm the only one out there. I know I'm not. I have friends that agree with me. I mean, one of my friends is mixed race. My other friend is also... They also agree on the whole all lives matter shit. So... It's not just me. She's mixed race. She disagrees with it. So you can't exactly get offended by it. Okay, so don't. Just don't. Right, I need to bring on Harry Kane. I completely forgot about him. Crespo, fuck yourself, you shit, mate. No, Gabriel Jesus is worse. Oh. How's everyone doing on FIFA now? Are they do people still play it anymore? I don't even know if this is going to get any views because it's FIFA and it is old, but is people really playing during the summer heat shit? People care about this game anymore? I certainly don't. I really don't. I spend so much money on this game, I get nothing back in rewards. I've spent probably a few hundred quid, if not more. My best tradable pack is Son. He went for 70k. <clears throat> and I'm seeing people out there who spend £10. They get fucking Team of the Season Messi, Team of the Year Messi, Team of the Season Ronaldo, all of that shit. And I'm out there getting a normal fucking Son. But then in my own tradable packs, I get people like fucking Ronaldo, fucking Shapeshifters, Reba Ree. It's just bollocks. It's just an absolute bollocks. And I get fucking. During the whole icon swap thing, I got fucking Blanc. Wait, good pull. Fucking love it, but. Come on. Give me something tradable, EA, please. He's getting stupid now. Pissing me off, so I cannot. There's no point. I've given up on this game. I used to be better. I used to be a lot better. Back in FIFA 13, I was a Division 1 player. I was great at the game. I wouldn't say great. I was okay. If I carried on playing it, I'd probably be about... Gold 1 player? Elite 3 pushing it? I'd probably be... I don't know. Division 3? Nowadays? If I carried on the way it was, I was decent. I just... After FIFA 13, FIFA 14 time, I sort of just dropped down and stopped caring. Came to FIFA 15, I was in Division 4, 5, just chilling. <clears throat> Didn't really bother. Didn't bother with foot champs when that came out. Just, the game isn't fun anymore. It's just too competitive for me, really. And I play games to have fun. And this game just isn't fun. Like, you have to have a good team to get anywhere. Like, you can't go round with fucking Mauro Zarate anymore. Or fucking, I don't know, Julian Draxler. And fucking wreck everything. You can't go round with fucking Funes Mori in your defence and he plays like fucking Van Dyke. Or fucking Varane. Or all that shit. Or Bonner. It's, it's not fun. You actually have to have a good team, which means you have to put money in or you have to grind this fucking game. And you get casuals out there who just don't want to do that. They want to get maybe a couple good players here and there, a few thousand coins, have a 100k team and still have fun. You know? But you just can't. You can't do that anymore. It's crap. I mean, look at Pez. It's just... That used to be fun and it's just not anymore. It's still better than FIFA. 100% better than FIFA. I just don't understand the menu so I can't be bothered to learn it so I stick to FIFA. 
Uh, Pez has really dropped off. That gameplay used to be fun. It used to be glitchy. It was funny. But now it's just they've focused on the realism too much. Whereas EA, they've just money. <laughs> All they give a shit about is money. They're just fucking absolute selfish wankers. They're fucking cunts, bro. Like they don't give a flying fuck. Like they're just they're pathetic. They're pathetic fucking toasters, bruv. They need to sort their fucking lives out. It's a piss take. Like make the fucking game enjoyable. But yet people just keep going back to their game. Over and over and over. It's just stop. If you want to have a good game, fucking stop buying it. And then they've got no other choice but to make it fun again. Then we actually have an enjoyable game, not some fucking bullshit. Where after fucking like what five, four years, whatever, the fucking no list glitch, no loss glitch is still around. Like, come the fuck on, really? Like fucking the button delay, that's still a fucking thing. Forty-five minute goals, ninetieth minute goals, fucking kickoff goals, they're still a fucking thing after years and years and years. It's bullshit. They need to get their fucking act together, but they won't. They just fucking won't. Because people like us just keep fucking throwing money at them like there's no tomorrow. Because we're fucking idiots. We are all fucking idiots. So not just me. But anyone watching this who plays FIFA 20. Fucking stop buying the piece of shit. Please. Stop. You've got fucking dickhead written on your forehead. I do. We're mugs to them. That's it. This is just bullshit. This game is just, this company, everything is just horseshit. And then off the topic, I've been playing uh, The Forest lately. I got that last week. Incredible game. That is an incredible game. The boring bits in the game are even fun. It's, it's just a good role play survival game. It's cheap. You can play it on your own and still have fun. Definitely recommend playing with <clears throat> one or two or three or wh however many friends you want to play with. But get the game. It's incredible. 13 quid on the PS Store. I think it's on offer now as well. So that's a bigger bonus. It's just, it's solid. It is just a solid, fun game. It's better than this pile of shit, I tell you. Unfortunately, there is no DLC, but that will make the game so much fucking better. Alright, so that should be two more objectives done. I just need to play three more games, which is lovely. Three assists for a number, I know, uh, I don't know why I'm fucking, yeah, why am I gloating? This fucking squad battles, you twat. How the hell does Gabriel Jesus get mad at a match? That baffles me. Anyway. I'm going to cut the video there, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I really hope you enjoyed. If not, then I won't upload again. But if we can get this video to 10 likes, 5 or 10 likes, then I will upload another one. And maybe I will be grinding for Zlatan Ibrahimovic, which would be nice. So, as I said, hope you enjoyed the video. Enjoy the rest of your day. Enjoy the rest of lockdown. Peace.